Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Here's our weekly grocery haul from Walmart. Let me show you everything we ended up getting today. Went ahead and bought the Ritz crackers. These toasted chips are delicious. My son likes them in the sour cream. So last week we got the plain salted ones. So we got him the sour cream ones this week. Grandma and him loves this uh, snack, so we got them. Got some white corn tortillas since we're going to be making steak tacos for dinner on the um, grill outside. So we got them. Some more eggs because I'm going to be doing some baking for this week for um, my mother-in-law so we can have some special cookies before she heads home. And then we ended up getting Greek yogurt again because I ran out of my um, Greek yogurt that I like to have in um with granola and fruit. Sometimes even putting this in like a cake mixture makes the cake a little bit more moist um, and healthier for you and less um, oils and stuff. So I bought that to use for some baking items as well. And like I said, for my morning granola yogurt. Got another gal half gallon of milk for my mother-in-law. Some more van French vanilla and hazelnut creamer for coffee because I'm running low. Then I got this um, Starbucks. We liked the Starbucks we got last week. So they actually had the blonde roast this time. So we bought one of them and the medium roast just in case we're not a fan of this. But I think we will because that's the one coffee I like to drink when I go to um, Starbucks. I usually get their hot blonde. I've never had their cold. So I'm excited to try that. Um, got some cilantro because we're going to make some more sofrito because we're running low. Um, taking out my last container that I have in the freezer and we're gonna use some of this for our tacos this evening with salsa and stuff got some more potatoes because my son's been loving his potatoes we're gonna make um, some potato salad as well as um, mashed so I got that um, we got tons of peppers for the tacos and also our sofrito this evening so when I make that with the cilantro we'll use all that up for that as well as tacos. Got some asparagus, cause love these on the grill or even roasted in the oven. Um, another thing of the chicken patties, my son really liked these, so I saw them again at Walmart. So I bought another pack for our freezer. Got a few of the Zero um, Shine vitamin waters. My, my husband likes them, so I got a, a couple more of them for him to have for the week. Um, couple of the Snapple Fruit Punch for my son and my mother-in-law. They like that as well. Um, got the regular bananas. Like I said, I get them a little green because by the time they ripen up, they're ready to eat and they don't go bad so quickly on us. So we'll probably be able to eat these in a couple of days. Got two more plantains because I've been enjoying um, tostones, they call them. I love them fried. But we may use these for, um, is it mango? Mango? My mother-in-law is going to um, make that one day for breakfast. So I bought that to try and have for breakfast one day. So I went ahead and bought this um, ground turkey. We're going to make a recipe by Michael Simon. It's kind of like a lasagna, but made with potatoes and ground chicken or turkey. So I'm going to make that with this. So we'll give that recipe a try. Haven't had that one out of his book. We like his recipes. Um, also picked up some grass-fed organic ground meat at Walmart. I love this um, particular brand that we get from them. Um, I don't know. I like the flavor. I feel like the meat is always good. So they had a three-pack there. So I went ahead and picked that up because we've been using the ground beef to make um, empanadas. My mother-in-law has been here, so we've made homemade empanada shells to um, make for my son. My son absolutely loves um, homemade uh, empanadas. So grandma spoiled him rotten by making them for him. I'm trying to look at the price for the meat. I think it was, hmm, I don't know. I can't find it on the receipt. It's 20 something dollars. I'll, I'll look that up and put it in the um, description because since I'm on the phone here, I can't find it so i'll i'll look for that now but i did get also these ribeye steaks for our um tacos and one for now one for later kind of thing since i saw them we like their cut 
cuts of beef there. Those are 24, um, 80, 64 and 2010. They're about, oh, just about almost, well, this one's almost two pounds and this one's a pound and a half practically. So that worked out. And then um, we ended up getting these smoked brats because we love these. I actually like them. My husband usually is the one that eats them, but I went ahead and um, tried them and really liked them. So I got four packages of those to put in the freezer, um, one for now, a couple for later. Since we are having company again, I thought why not put them in the freezer for when um, visitors come again for barbecues and whatnot. So we did that. And then I also went ahead and bought regular hot dogs. My son does not like the brats, so we went ahead and bought that for him. Um, so he has hot dogs. Again, all these hot dogs, they know these brats. What's the one thing I forget? Hot dog buns. Thank goodness we're eating them till tomorrow. So we probably can run out tomorrow to get some hot dog buns. Um, got some fresh mushrooms. I kind of bought the ones already cut up. I should have bought the other ones now that I think about it because now it's going to be harder to wash them if they're dirty. But I was looking for convenience. I'm going to make a bunch of them to go with my um, with my uh, tacos. Even though I know it doesn't go with tacos, I love um, mushrooms with my steaks. So I'll probably make a couple of them tonight even though it's not a typical thing in tacos. But I'm going to make it typical. A shredded iceberg lettuce, again, went for the convenience because I did not want to sit here chopping up lettuce. So went ahead and did a small bag because now they have the eight ounce bags, which is pretty cool. So I um, got them. Bought some more um, tomatoes to make myself some salsa. And I have um, jalapeno and a lemon for our chicken dishes that we're making as well. So. That is the food. Oh, I forgot onions that I needed because I ran totally out of our onions. So we bought a package of them as well. And I also bought the pool this time because our son's pool popped a hole and he likes to have this in the backyard just to kick around in and get wet since it's been like 90 degree weather here. Pardon my watch. My husband keeps going in and out of the door. So my alarm is binging me telling me someone's entering and exiting um and he was rooting through my silverware drawer while I was talking as well so sorry about that noise if you heard that but so we went ahead and replaced the pool I mean this pool is about let's see how much is this pool I can't see everything on this receipt it's so faded 24.88 so not bad for um you know the season so we went ahead and got that for him and while we were there my son um asked us to look at the toys because he wasn't with us and we came across the four um, figures. He absolutely loves um, these uh, particular line of figures. So we went ahead and got them. So he's excited to play around with them when time comes. But this is our order. Um, like I said, we spent $279, um, not a very big haul, pricey, but not a very big haul so that's kind of like concerning because you know it's not a lot of food but in the scheme of things it is for us because like that's gonna last us the brats for a while and the hot dogs and this is about a couple of meals here and then those are so I mean we did good on meats it's just like I said a lot more pricier than we're used to so this is my order comment below did you get anything fun in your grocery haul this um, time. Are you cooking anything fun on the grill? Comment below. Love to hear what recipes or food you're making on the grill this week. Well, my friends, have a great day. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for stopping by. I really appreciate you following. Hit that like button, subscribe, and notifications to see me in the next one.